Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel and if you're new, what up? Today I'm here to talk to you guys about a very exciting body care collection that I have been using recently and that is Taraji P. Henson's body care line. So I actually found out about her body care collection here recently and I was so intrigued by it because for one, y'all, they sell it at Walmart, okay? So it's easily accessible to everybody and the products are so affordable. They are so inexpensive. She has products ranging from like seven to I believe twelve dollars and she even has candles that are super affordable and reasonably priced as well so y'all I had to take a look into her body care line so there's three different lines within the collection so you have like the energizing mandarin and ginger line then you have the vanilla and tuberose kind of like the moisturizing line and then you have the ylang ylang and palo santo line which is more so for like winding down for bedtime so we're gonna get into all of that you guys but I literally have to tell y'all how good these products are seriously I've pretty much used everything here I don't have every single piece from the entire collection but I do have fairly enough items from each one of the lines to actually talk to you guys about and share my thoughts with y'all so if y'all are interested in seeing all that then just keep on watching Okay, you guys, so I'm actually on my phone right now and you can get her body care line from her actual website, which is TPH by Taraji. You can also get it at Target. I didn't even know that. I thought it was kind of like a Walmart exclusive, but yeah, you can also get it at Target and then you can get it at Walmart and the prices seem to be relatively the same from Target to Walmart. And if I'm being honest, I think going in store is your best bet to get all of these products because I don't know, online is just a hassle. And when I went in my store, I was able to find pretty much everything from every line in store. Okay, so now let's get into the products. I'm really excited to talk to you guys about these items. So I did use some of the things today, but like I said, I have been testing them out for the last week or so since I've gotten them. So I pretty much use everything here. Um, okay, so the first thing we have is the Good Days Energizing Gel Body Cleanser in the Mandarin and Ginger scent. So this is what her packaging looks like. It's pretty sleek and very simple packaging. All of her products have this same like bottle shape and the same design. They just come in like different colors. So this one is more of a lighter beige and then the vanilla and tuberose line is more of a darker beige and then the palo santo and ylang ylang line is a dark brown color so this is pretty much all news and it's very aesthetically pleasing i actually like the actual packaging of the body care so like i said this is the gel body cleanser i did use this today because i just wanted to see how energizing and refreshing it would feel since it's supposed to be like a collection that wakes you up in the morning this does have a really nice smell so i thought that i would be a little bit turned off from the mandarin and ginger but this one is actually really nice it has this herbal spa smell and it kind of smells like that body wash that I bought from Suave that's also I believe mandarin and ginger it kind of smells like that so it is very energizing it's also refreshing but it's not going to be something super sweet or fruity or anything like that it definitely has this herbal scent to it which I think is kind of nice sometimes you just want to have something that puts you in self-care mode that gives you like a spa and therapeutic feel to it okay so this one says just what you need to kickstart your morning and your mood good days is an invigorating gel body cleanser that awakens your senses uplifts your spirits and gets you prepared to tackle the day finish your shower feeling bright boosted and in a good days and honestly it definitely did that for me this morning i kind of did like a whole energizing routine like a whole warm weather energizing routine this morning so it was definitely nice to use this one and it says it's infused with ginger and ashwagandha I have no idea what that is, but I'm assuming that it's some type of plant or something. And of course, her body care line is formulated with all skin in mind and it's pH friendly, vegan, cruelty free, sulfate free, tylate free, paraben free, mineral oil, everything like it. It has no bad ingredients in it whatsoever. So you can feel comfortable putting this on your body and feeling good about it. So yeah, I definitely did like this. The lather is really good on this, actually. I did use a lot of it, like how I do with my other body washes, but the lather on this is actually super nice. So it gives you like nice bubbles a good amount of bubbles okay and then the next thing that i went in with today this is the leave on hydrating daily body lotion again in the mandarin and ginger scent so this one says infused with ceramides amino acids and niacinamide now i really actually like this lotion i feel like this would be a really perfect lotion for hot weather because when you put it on it absorbs into the skin really really quickly like you're not spending five ten minutes moisturizing and rubbing this into your skin like with some products where it's hard for it to absorb so you're just sitting 
sitting there literally rubbing it in your skin all day this is not that it absorbs super super quick like within seconds and it doesn't leave a film on your skin so you're not stuck with like this sticky or greasy or oily feeling it actually absorbs into the skin and you're left with nothing like you can't feel anything after you put this lotion on so I think this would be really really nice to use for hot weather so that you don't feel heavy and like greasy and all of that stuff so I think a lot of people would really like this lotion so it actually says this daily lotion is packed with skin loving ingredients to weightlessly hydrate the skin key ingredients like ceramides and amino acids help retain your skin's moisture we're guaranteed you won't have an off day so I actually really like this lotion and the scent didn't linger too much to where when I put on my body care all I could smell was this instead of the actual body care that i wanted to smell like so this is an actual nice lotion and then the next thing super super good i didn't use it today but i used it like earlier in the week this is the ish condition moisturizing in shower skin conditioner if you guys watch my empties video i was just saying how i hadn't had an in shower lotion in a minute because i was trying to go through like my body oils and stuff like that this in shower lotion right here is chef's kiss it is beating out a lot of the other generic in shower lotions that i had used from other brands so this one is infused with squalene and jojoba oil now i will say unlike the lotion this one actually does leave kind of like an oilier base on your skin but it's not to the point where it feels sticky or it feels greasy you literally are moisturized like your skin is so healthy looking like it literally looks like this gives you the glow of what a body oil or something would so this actually does leave something on your skin but your skin still feels conditioned and nourished so i really like this one so it says what if we told you that you should condition your body too yes the ish condition is a one-of-a-kind in shower moisturizing cream that allows you to achieve soft supple skin before you even leave the bathroom without that sticky residue or greasy feeling this conditioner is perfect for the days you need an extra layer of nourishment or want to save time on post shower moisturizing which we all know is pretty much what an in shower lotion is for if you want to like skip putting lotion on your body when you get out of the shower you kind of just want to go in with an in shower moisturizer and then go in with your scented products then that is what this is for and like i said it doesn't leave you feeling super greasy but it does give you the glow of like an oil so i highly recommend this all of the products from the mandarin and ginger line i highly recommend them the next thing we're going to move into is the vanilla and tuberose line now this is the one that i think so many people are going to enjoy because the scent in this is immaculate like y'all it's so beautiful and it can layer with so many different things the smell on this is just to die for it's beautiful and it actually smells like something that i'm already familiar with like it's definitely a familiar scent but i can't quite put my finger on like what it is what i'm smelling so anyway we're gonna start with now i know i'm missing something from this line and i don't know if it's like a body wash or what but we're gonna start with the baby buffed exfoliating body polish that also has lactic acid so you guys should already know lactic acid is a chemical exfoliant so it really makes your skin look better it helps with cell turnover it helps if you have dark spots and things like that i use lactic acid on my skin on my face so i know what it can do so if you're including that on your body then the skin on your body is going to be nice and pretty blemish free soft non-textured all of that good stuff so i love that they put a chemical exfoliant in an actual physical exfoliating product so it says smooth silky and buff baby this super lush body polish uses the dual power of lactic acid and sugar to provide just the right amount of exfoliation the result skin left feeling supple and renewed use it on your back thighs or booty for baby buff skin infused with lactic acid glycolic acid rice powder niacinamide once again i'm referring back to my empties video because if you guys saw that video you saw all of my skincare products that i use on my skin y'all know i use glycolic acid i use niacinamide and i use lactic acid so the fact that they have all of that in this body exfoliator your skin is going to be amazing with this product i have already used this one it's a nice it's a nice like actual exfoliating scrub it's not tree hut texture but it's about that okay it's really exfoliating for sure and it has more of a thicker like consistency so it's really really nice it actually does a great job at exfoliating but like i told y'all the scent the scent on these products is just absolutely amazing so i do highly recommend the exfoliator and then the next things we're going to get into is the wash me whip 
niacinamide body cream and the softer than a mother decadent silkening body butter you would think that these products are one and the same because one's a body cream one's a body butter but they're actually fairly different and i'm going to show you guys the texture so the body cream is actually that it's an actual body cream um, y'all can see that I've definitely dug my fingers in here and used it. It is so good. It smells amazing. This reminds me of like the body creams from Bath and Body Works. It has a very creamy, um, almost thick texture, but it's not super duper hard. Now, the actual body butter, I haven't used this one yet. It still has the sealed um, film protection on it. But this is what this one looks like. So it looks like an actual body butter, like a shea butter or something. It's very, very thick as you guys can see it's not a cream it's more of a butter texture so this one is going to moisturize your skin a lot it's going to be a lot thicker this would probably be something that you would want to use in the winter time just for like extra extra hydration so let me see what these say Okay, so the whipped body cream is infused with niacinamide and fatty acids, and then the body butter is infused with shea butter and moringa oil. So this one is thicker, but it's a delectably whipped body cream that goes the extra mile with a team of dual action ingredients that do all the work. This hydrating and exfoliating cream works harder for your skin, so you don't have to. And the actual body butter says, this solid body butter packed with luxurious oils melts onto your skin and moisturizes every nook and cranny that only a mother's love can provide. So yes, they are different, but they do provide moisture for your skin. They are thoroughly, thoroughly hydrating. I love the actual body cream. I've been using it here recently before I go to bed and it just makes my skin feel so soft and just like luxuriously scented. Like these products, the vanilla and tuberose line, these products make me feel luxurious. Like they give me that luxury feeling. So highly recommend the body butter and the body cream. And the last thing that I have from this line is the Anything Glows Luxe Lightweight Body Oil. Yeah, I know how I feel about my body oils. I am all for them. I think that you need them. If you've never tried a body oil before, you absolutely need to. This one right here is probably my favorite body oil. I did use this today, actually. This is probably my favorite body oil that I have right now in my collection. So it is infused with squalane, avocado oil, and rose hip oil. This luxuriously lightweight body oil leaves your thirsty skin feeling moisturized, soft, and radiant. Glow off with a natural dewy glimmer from head to toe. This is perfect and I will be using this in the summer. I know y'all are probably thinking like, who wants to use an oil during the summer and be cooking in that sun? But I'm definitely going to be using this oil to moisturize my skin for the summertime because this does not leave you feeling super greasy like an oil like you think an oil would this is definitely more moisturizing it sinks into the skin easily especially if you use it on damp skin and it doesn't leave like this super heavy residue on your skin it just does what it's supposed to it moisturizes and it leaves your skin with a nice glow in the smell once again this vanilla and tuberose, y'all need to get y'all nose on this scent because it smells so just high end and luxe. I love it. Okay, and so then the very last thing that I have, this is from the Ylang Ylang and Palo Santo line, which is supposed to be more of like your bedtime wind down scent. Now I know that there's way more products in this line, but I only have one, which is the Bubble or Nothing Comforting Bath Elixir. So in this line, I think you do have another scrub and it's like a duo product where you can use it in the tub as like a bath. I think it's like a um, like a bath wash and you can also use it as an exfoliator I didn't think I needed that since I already have an exfoliator in um, this line but yeah and it also has a candle as well I didn't pick up pretty much anything from this line other than this so this one says infused with oat milk and oatmeal extract bath time should be you time and bubble or nothing dares you to claim it this creamy comforting bath elixir promotes foam filled relaxation while cocooning your skin with milk and oat extracts the perfect treat at the end of a stressful week for pampering and pleasure so the smell of this one the ylang ylang and the palo santo is so good you guys like literally this definitely smells like something really calming and soothing and something you would use at the end of your day without it smelling like you know lavender because I am not a lavender person and I know that there's plenty of other things out there that can lull you to sleep other than lavender so I love the fact that this is different and it doesn't include any lavender but it still treats you and calms your senses down so that you can you know drift off to sleep so I really like this and I will definitely be using this because I was just saying that I need to start taking more bubble baths I have been neglecting on my bubble baths I took one the other day was it earlier this week or last week 
I took a bubble bath and I was like, why don't I take more of these? You know, I definitely need to treat myself. So that is what I will be doing with this new bath elixir. So I highly recommend that product as well. I highly recommend everything from this collection if you guys can't tell already. I think she did an amazing job with her body care line. The fact that it's available to everyone at all of these different drugstores, the fact that it is so affordable and not crazily expensive because usually celebrities, when they come out with a line, they try and hit you over the head with that price just because their name is on it. So I love the fact that she made this affordable the aesthetic of it is really really nice and then the products themselves actually work they actually do what they're supposed to do and they actually make me feel like i want to do self-care so that was the whole point of this body care line and she nailed it absolutely so i would 100 recommend that you guys try these products out and let me know what you think if you have already down in the comments if you guys like this video go ahead and give it a big thumbs up and leave me a comment down below let me know that you enjoyed it if you're new thank you so much for watching you should definitely go ahead and hit that subscribe button join the fragrance to beauty army as well as that bell notification so that you can be notified every single time that i upload a video and i'll see you guys in my next one peace